Hello everyone. So finally, we do have data stories with us with Tableau 2022.2. So you, so this is available now, and the download will be, link will be there at the description. So I'm going to give you a short demo. Maybe some of the points are not covered over here, so I'll I'll talk about that as well, so that it will be a smooth journey for you in order to get the output easily and fast. So basically, data stories it help any user to confidently access, understand, and communicate with data. So it will automatically anal analyze and build the communication of insight. So generally, like in my previous company, we used to spend a lot of time, you know, after exporting our uh, data visualization to PDF, again, you need to write about uh, the KPIs so that you present that in front of the executive. Now this will be useful there as well, or any individual who is the user or say stakeholder of this very particular dashboard or say story, and he can access the story in a simple way, in plain language. Now, this is like an extension, right? You have those dashboard extensions. This is one of the new extension that you will see. So if you come to your dashboard uh, under object, you can see a new object called data story. The use is very, very simple. But then before that, something which is not mentioned over there, that it works only with the published data source. So once you are coming to your dashboard, don't expect this to work without publishing your data source. And before that, you should be definitely should be signed in, into your Tableau server, right? And after that, you need to uh, definitely ensure that those data sources are published. So I've ensured that my all the data sources are published over there, as you can see. Step number one, sign in to your Tableau server and show that your all, da all the data sources are published. Now let us try to build some story. Just we can just drag and drop it like any other object that you have. Here you go. The, once you drop it, a new window will open, right? This page will open, which says extension data story. So you will have to choose one of the worksheet which is being used here. So I go with product view and say next. After that, you need to pick, right? There can be, there can be maximum two dimensions over there. So we have, they have ignored year and they have month and category. And I'm quite okay with that. Also, uh, as per your product view, there are two measures over there. Some of profits. So if you want to remove one of the two, you can do that. But okay, let me take both. Or can I just try to show you that you can ignore one of the two as well? Or maybe I put my sum of sales back and put some of profit out. Yeah. All those from profit makes sense. But I'm just trying to show you the the feature over there. Next. So the best fit is can be discrete, but for this very particular sheet, uh, they think that the best fit is the continuous form. So you have already got uh, the data story over there. So let us see how much sense it makes. And also I will show you that whether the numbers are actually matching the, you know, the true data set over there or not. Like for example, the, the total sum sales was 2.3 million across all the three entities and across all the 12 periods. Okay, let us go and check. And if I can just go and pick any sheet and if I say sales over there. So whether the overall sales it's like two, three, six. I think this, the, the numbers are matching. 2.3 million. I think this number is 2.3 million. Uh, yes, right. So we are good. So it's it's like you know, it starts with that summary, which is quite good because that can be the starting point for your presentation. I have expanded it further. And after that, we can say that 2.3 million in sum of sales across all the entities was driven by technology. Means track technology is at the top with this number, furniture with this. And that we can understand. But whether the numbers are okay or not we can go back to our sheet 23 uh sorry 24 and we'll bring in category over there and we can see the numbers are quite matching if you see 839893 and that's what they are talking about over there 839893. We are good with the numbers. Now they are uh, explaining or telling the story of, you know, uh, for example, the total sum of sales increased by 36K over the most recent period driven by furniture. So it shows the percent hike with respect to different categories, which is quite important. Also, it shows the decrease over there from December to January, sum of sales decreased by 234149 again driven by furniture so we are not doing very good at furniture and this can be the conversation when you are trying to present the insight with respect to different product or product categories 
again they have drilled down to technology they're just talking about technology over there and drilling down over there furniture and then office supplies so it looks very organized that's what you would do uh it will definitely going to save a lot of time and it will also enable any user to understand what is going on so i like this new feature and i hope you liked it too at the end i would just say that keep on dancing with data kyunki data hi data hai kya tumko sab ko jata hai